The Department of Cooperative Governance and Traditional Affairs gazetted new bylaws to regulate the operations of spaza shops and other traders in townships. This comes as a food poisoning crisis has hit South Africa and has claimed the lives of about 23 children so far. At a briefing, Gauteng Premier Panyaza Lisufi said the Agriculture Department would address the issue of organophosphate, a toxic chemical found in rat poison, which has been linked to some of the deaths. We'll have targeted raids and we'll also close the shops that don't comply. But there's the process of closing those shops uh, that we will attend to and utilize the law enforcement agencies. So we've agreed then we'll meet every Saturday to take stock and then we'll brief you uh, on Sundays on the resolutions that we have taken so that we follow this matter until we are dead sure that we don't have this situation uh, arising in our communities. Part of the document states that a person who contravenes or fails to comply with the provision of this bylaw, fails to comply with a notice issued in terms of this bylaw, fails to comply with a lawful instruction given in terms of this bylaw, is guilty of an offence and must be served with a written warning advising of the offence, remedial action and applicable times, consequences for failure to redress and the appeal process. Share your thoughts with us on this.